pap smear results. There are a number of possible outcomes from an anal pap smear. In about 5 to 10% of cases, the result is what's called technically unsatisfactory. What this means is, is that inadequate numbers of cells were collected at the time of the procedure. This didn't mean there's anything specifically wrong in the anal area from which the sample is taken, just that technically some problems had arisen. In these circumstances, a simple repeat of the procedure will usually clarify the issue. Negative for squamous intraepithelial lesions. This means effectively that the pap smear was entirely normal. Ascus. The term ascus stands for atypical squamous cells of undetermined significance. In essence, the laboratory has identified some abnormalities, doesn't have sufficient information to be able to categorize the pap smear as any either abnormal or normal. This is commonly associated with mild wart virus infections, LCIL, or low-grade squamous intraepithelial lesions. The abnormalities seen in an LCIL pap smear are those of a benign wart virus infection. It is not associated with any significant likelihood of anal cancer. ASCH stands for atypical squamous cells of undetermined significance, possible high grade. What this means is the laboratory has identified some abnormal looking cells which are suggestive but not conclusive that there may be high grade disease present. HSIL, high grade squamous intraepithelial lesions. The pap smear has cells strongly suggestive of the presence of precancerous lesions.